Taki Fusa Kubo is a rising Japanese football star born on June 4, 2001. Beginning at FC Barcelona's youth academy La Masia, Kubo gained early recognition. He set records in the J-League and secured a deal with Real Madrid. Loan spells at RCD Mallorca, Villarreal, and Getafe enhanced his skills. In July 2022, he permanently joined Real Sociedad, quickly becoming a key player both domestically and internationally. This is a tactical analysis on Takifusa Kubo. Takifusa Kubo's dribbling ability is one of the standout aspects of his game. He is a natural left-footed right winger which provides him with a significant advantage when it comes to cutting inside and taking on defenders. In the current season, he has demonstrated his effectiveness in carrying the ball forward through progressive runs. These runs not only advance the team up the pitch but also put pressure on the opposition's defense. Kubo's impressive 70% dribble success rate indicates that he can navigate through tight spaces and bypass defenders with ease. This exceptional dribbling ability allows him to create goal-scoring opportunities for himself and his teammates. Real Sociedad's attacking style benefits greatly from a player like Kubo, who can break down defensive lines and open up space for his colleagues. Scoring goals consistently is a significant challenge for any player, and Kubo has shown that he has the potential to be a prolific scorer. He often targets the center and left side of the goal, indicating his preference for using his strong left foot and ability to exploit specific areas of the goal. This understanding of goal scoring angles and positions is crucial for a forward, and Kubo's proficiency in this aspect of this game is evident. His ability to use his left foot to attempt shots from the right side demonstrate his versatility in the attack. This season's early success indicates that Kubo is not only a skillful dribbler, but also a clinical finisher who can find the back of the net when presented with goal scoring opportunities. Kubo's passing game has also evolved and become an integral part of Real Sociedad's attacking strategy. He is not just a goal scorer, he is a provider as well. Kubo has showcased his ability to create goal scoring opportunities for his teammate while also showing capacity to stretch the opposition defense and deliver precise crosses and passes into the penalty box. Kubo's passing style is marked by his ability to play precise through balls and cutback opportunities for his teammates. He has demonstrated more composure this season and has attempted to create more threat creating opportunities. This increased creativity in his passing allows Real Sociedad to diversify their attacking play, making it harder for opponents to predict their movement. He has shown the potential to create goal scoring opportunities and assist his teammates in critical moments, making him a versatile asset in their quest for success at the highest level of European competition. Now let's summarize what we've learned about Takifusa Kubo. In his dribbling, he has demonstrated his effectiveness in carrying the ball forward through progressive runs. With his finishing, he often targets the center and left side of the goal, indicating his preference for using his strong left foot and ability to exploit specific areas of the goal. And finally, his passing, his ability to play precise through balls and cut back opportunities for his teammates. And that is it for this video. Make sure you like, subscribe, share, and comment, and let me know who you want to see next. But until then, keep learning and keep analyzing.